what's going on guys my name is Zeke and welcome back to another COD top 5 video now in this video I'll cover top 5 worst mystery box weapons that you can get from the mystery box obviously and uh, yeah in the whole Call of Duty history of the zombies so there are a lot of weapons that you get from the mystery box and people just, just don't appreciate them and I'll cover top 5 worst one of them so without further ado guys let's start off so at number 5 we've got the VR-11 from the Black Ops 1 map, uh, DLC map, Call of the Dead. Now this is actually a wonder weapon, so not as that, because all the wonder weapons that we had so far in Call of Duty Zombies were super super overpowered or just very very good weapons, but this wonder weapon is actually useless. Now for those who don't know what it does, it actually turns zombies into humans and then sends and it, it's actually kind of a monkey bomb but the zombie basically becomes a human and then the zombies follow him and in just around 30 seconds he disappears and then the zombies start following you back and you know I think the monkey bombs are way more better because first of all this weapon does not do any damage to zombies at all it just turns them into the humans which is like the most useless thing and the monkey bombs actually do pretty good damage to the zombies, so you can just finish them off after the monkey explodes. And especially it's useless on solo, you know, maybe if you're playing 3-4 players and then someone's down and you just hit a zombie with this weapon and he turns into a human and then you can revive your teammates, maybe that's how it's used, but this is probably the most, uh, you know, useless wonder weapon that I've ever seen in my life. And uh, yeah, so guys... I have nothing to say about that, you know, if you haven't checked out that gun already, just don't be so excited when you get it, because I was so excited when I got it first time, but then it turned out that it was completely, you know, a piece of crap, so, yeah, let's move on to number four. So at number four, guys, comes the ballistic knife, um, so I decided to put this on number four, because this is a little bit less useful than the VR-11, because you actually can do, um, you know, pretty good with this weapon, uh, with this knife, actually, uh, you know, round 10, 11 maybe, that's two hit, two hit kill, you know, and after that, you know, it's just no point of using it because you're gonna get down at some point and it's just a very bad weapon to stay with. Unless you pack a punch it when you're playing with someone, then you shoot the pack a punch knife into your teammate who is actually down and then you can revive him with that shot, which is pretty useful, but you know, we're not considering pack a punched weapons here, it's just a weapon that you get straight up from the mystery box and that is not useful. So, I don't know, I think the VR-11 is a little bit more useful than the Ballistic Knife, but that's just my opinion, guys. You can leave the comments below and tell me your top 5 worst weapons. But anyway, let's move on to number 3. So guys, moving on to number 3, we've got the RPG. So, this thing is really, you know, the worst thing that you can get from the Mystery Box, because like every time I open a Mystery Box and get the RPG, I'm like, alright, RPG, taking it, and then re-spinning re the box again because like that's the most useless weapon that you can ever have I mean you can kill a lot of zombies but you don't get that much XP for it and you know there's you know a high chance that you're gonna hit yourself and probably get down after that hit when the, when a zombie hits you once or twice if you're having the juggernaut but this is probably you know, an, you know the most inefficient weapon I'd say but unless you pack a bunch of guys, it becomes a really good weapon, and especially if you have the PGD flopper, which is not available on many maps in Call of Duty at all. But as I said, we don't consider pack a punched weapons, just pack a, uh, just the weapons from the mystery box. So guys, keep that in mind. And yeah, RPG man, what do you gotta do with the RPG man? You just take out a you know bunch of zombies, you know, make some crawlers. Maybe that's the thing. But I I don't see. That many people staying with it, so let's move on to number two. So, guys, at number two, we've got the War Machine. Now, this weapon is available in all Black Ops 2 maps, I believe, and this is like I don't know how to explain how bad this weapon is. Like, this is a grenade launcher that launches grenade and they ricochet everywhere, they don't actually explode on impact, so they're not a straight up exploding machine. So, they basically just you know shoot grenades and they have to take some time to explode basically and that's the most useful way now the only thing that you can do with this weapon is shoot um, zombies with it 
and uh, it will, uh, you know, kind of do some damage at early rounds, but nowhere near round 15 or something. You gotta change that weapon as fast as possible if you get it at a higher round. So yeah, that's for the War Machine and number two. Moving on to number one and probably the less, you know, the most useless weapon and most uh, underpowered. So at number one, guys, we have the SMR. That's right, the SMR from Black Ops 2 is probably the uh, the most underpowered weapon. Like it takes, I believe, ten shots to kill an yeah to kill a zombie on round nine, ten, I believe. That is like so so weak. I mean, the weapon is very very weak, guys. Even if you pack a punch, it's not going to be that much useful. Even if you use double tap on it, it's not going to be that useful, guys. So I I just rather uh you know use something else on this weapon because I've used it. And, you know, in multiplayer, it doesn't seem that bad, but in zombies, you know, man, it's just the worst weapon ever in Call of Duty history, man. So, yeah, that's guys it for the top five this video, and I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe for more. Catch you guys next time. Peace out.